this is Artifacts of Mars, and I'm going to uh, follow up on that story about uh, Portland Community College, where in my opinion they're advocating genocide against white race, either cultural or physical. See, with Hitler, the Nazis have started all this kind of cultural genocide, if there is such a thing, where the Nazis, you know, debased and tried to destroy Jewish culture. They didn't start out by gassing the Jews. Well, anyway, so somebody posted this article from Salon.com, which is a notorious left-wing site. Now, in the video, which I, I'll, I'll bring this up in a minute, in the video they say this was inspired by groups like and that can be this Black Lives Matter. I'm gonna put this on hold, I'll bring that up, play the video, and we'll show you that. And this is on other sites as well. Alright, here's the place in Swan well, that uh, where they admit that this was inspired by Black Lives Matter. Do you really need to know anything more than this? Uh Black Lives Matter is a vicious anti-white hate organization. Portland Community College recently announced that the faculty will host first White History Month, no, it's Whiteness History Month at Oregon School during the month of April. You are a liar, 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 pants on fire. Uh, unlike the ignorant, culturally insensitive people don't understand Black History Month, and therefore claim there should be a similar one from white people, which this is not. This event is designed to force a more nuanced discussion of society as it exists, how that society privileges people from a certain background and disadvantages people from other backgrounds. The school's community relations manager said. The idea is that by examining whiteness, students may be able to better understand the reality that cultural differences in different races have different experiences and vastly different outcomes when it comes to wealth, health, and quality of life. Uh, that's a bunch of bullshit. That is bullshit. And I have to bring out my pet cow for that. That is bullshit. Okay, uh, in Portland, they had the name of the community director that community relations manager Abe Proctor, uh, is PCC's community relations manager, and of course, he's denying that there's a, any kind of a problem, which is he's a major liar. So, uh, I'm not waiting to hear the rest, by the way. This is scary stuff. I think the uh, reaction from the internet crowd has been rather tepid, to be honest with you. And people should have been calling for, uh, uh, jail, I don't know about jail time, but for uh, the entire staff to lose their uh, teaching credentials. The entire school should lose all funding. All public funding should be taken away from Portland Community College. All of it. And all the, all the staff, as far as I'm concerned, should lose their teaching credentials. All of them would lose their credentials. Right on the spot and we get some new teachers in there and we we'll actually teach kids instead of indoctrinating them. So I have a couple more things to show you. Hang on. Uh, this apparently is one of the newspapers, Oregon Line. OregonLive.com College administrations were caught off guard Monday when bloggers and social media sites started buzzing with word that Oregon's largest college was playing a series of events this spring to 
perpetuate whiteness shaming. That's not what I've said. I've gone further. See, first they attack the culture, then the camps will come later. They're not going to start putting us in, trying to put us in camps yet. But if these people aren't stopped, if these people are stopped now, then uh, we can prevent any type of bloodshed, anybody being put in the camps. We can prevent it all. We can prevent another holocaust, that's what I'm saying. Whiteness History Month has been discussed as a possible event at PCC since 2014. Inspired by groups such as Black Lives Matter. That's all you need to know. Right there. That is, you know, Black Lives Matter is obviously a vicious anti-white hate group. That's all you need to know right there. And they admit it's not a so slow celebratory endeavor. Sorry, I have trouble with that word. Celebratory. Unbelievable. I ain't gonna show you Black Lives Matter if it comes up. This is actually is called progressive site. We are unapologetically black in our positioning and affirming that Black Lives Matter. We need not qualify a position to love and desire freedom and justice for ourselves is a necessary prerequisite for wanting the same for others. We are committed to practicing empathy. We engage comrades. Gee, where did that word come from? With the intent to learn about and connect with their contacts. I mean, need I go on? This is a this is a pretty typical progressive uh, website. Well, it's full of hate for whites, of course. Yeah, diversity for everybody except for whites. We are committed to acknowledging, respecting, and celebrating differences and commonalities. So, there you have it. Uh, this, is, this college is being guided by essentially a hardcore racist group, Black Lives Matter. Do you need to know any more? I told you. They're trouble. This is trouble with a capital T. I go a lot further than other so-called bloggers. Uh, I am furious about this. And you can bet that I will be following up on it. I have a letter sitting on my laptop. I just haven't had time to take it and print it up and send it off to that college. And you can bet that it's not pleasant. I don't have it on my desktop, it's on my laptop, so I'm not going to bother with it, but I let them have it. You can bet on that. This is Artifacts of Mars. This has been a follow-up. You're in grave danger, people. I don't care what nobody says. No, they're not going to start hauling you off to camps right yet and gassing you, but, uh, give them time. First they go after the culture, then they'll degrade us to second-class citizens, and then come the cattle cars. First they have to disarm us, of course. They tried loading us on cattle cars, uh, the way the Nazis did. Right now, there'd be a revolution right on the spot. I'm Artifacts Mars. Thanks for watching.